Hi everybody and uh, welcome to our 26th day in our journey to awesome. Uh, sorry for the delay today, just got done with a very uh, uh, intense uh, emotional board meeting that uh, I get the uh, privilege of serving on this board and strangely enough it was wrapped around giving our uh, prior subject and you know what I need right now is our current subject. Uh, as we talked about yesterday, uh, fun, laughing, lightning is a, not lightning, that's the bolt, lightning, uh, is a really powerful force in opening up your heart and unlocking uh, some of the emotional composition uh, that can really help drive you forward. You know, the people that laugh easily, that can smile easily, uh, they tend to be very, very healthy, energetic, productive folks, and that's where we all want to be. So today's challenge is going to be, yesterday I asked you to think about lightening up, not taking yourself so seriously about things. You know, do serious work? Absolutely. Uh, take yourself seriously? Absolutely not. Uh, tonight, I want to challenge you in another regard to think about something. And then not only think about it, but behind it, find it. And I'll give a little credit on this too. Uh, find what makes you really laugh. Now, I'm not talking about the little ha 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 chuckle. I'm not talking about, oh my, that's clever. I'm talking about what makes you belly laugh. I gotta tell you, I got a couple of go-to movies. Uh, my ex-wife listens to Jim Gaffigan uh, audio, which by the way, Jim Gaffigan is a funny guy. He's hilarious and he causes me to belly laugh. But there's something out there, you all have it, that just makes you belly laugh. Uh, sometimes it's playing with your kids and you know doing little things like that, just, just you just break out in that all body, total energy, total emotion, by uh, belly laugh thing. And I want you to think about what that is for you. Uh, I mean, I'll confess, mine is uh, Young Frankenstein and Blazing Saddles from Mel Brooks. Those are my go-to just laugh out loud movies. And I know I'm dating myself with that and that's okay, I don't care. Uh, a couple of comedians and a couple of little sketches that they have, it just makes me laugh out loud. Uh, doing silly stuff with kids, uh, somersaults and barrel rolls and things like that, just barrel laugh stuff. So I want you to find it. Then I want you to commit when you're going to do that in the next 72 hours, when you're going to find that, you're going to find time for that movie, find time for that comedian's clip, find time for that activity that just makes you laugh out loud and unleash that emotional composition that goes with that laughter and turn that laughter into a, just a regular all the time thing. The other thing I'm gonna ask you to think about, do you have friends? Well, I, I'm guessing we all do. Do you have friends that absolutely, whoever they are, wherever they're at, will make you laugh, will make you smile? <laughs> I know I do. I, I There is always, I, I got a, I, I'm blessed to have one that is absolutely perfectly religious that I get to talk to, to her a great deal. And then there's another couple of friends that always, always make me smile. And I got to tell you, talk to them, find them, touch them, do something. But when you're around them, they make you smile. So guess what? Be around them more. This is real easy stuff. Lighten up. That was yesterday. Today, we're going to unlock some belly laughs and find that friend in your life, that person in your life that consistently makes you smile and reach out and touch them. Tomorrow, we'll talk a little bit more about fun and how to incorporate some things into your routine to make that a regular, regular habit set to keep that practice going. Guys, have a terrific evening, and I look forward to talking to you tomorrow.